നമസ്തെ ഓൾ ഓൺ ദ ഓസ്പീഷ്യസ് ഒക്കേഷൻ ഓഫ് നവരാത്രി ട്വന്റി ട്വന്റി ടു പരം ഫോർ മ്യൂസിക് ആൻഡ് ആർട്സ് സെന്റർ ഹാപ്പിലി പ്രസൻസ് അവർ നവരാത്രി സീരീസ് സ്റ്റാർട്ടിംഗ് ഫ്രം ട്വന്റി സിക്സ് സെപ്റ്റംബർ ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ദ പ്രഥമ ഓർ ഫസ്റ്റ് ഡേ ഓഫ് നവരാത്രി നവരാത്രി ദ നയൻ നൈറ്റ്സ് ഓഫ് നവദുർഗ ബിലോങ് ടു ദ നയൻ അവതാർസ് ഓഫ് ഗോഡസ് ദുർഗ ഈച്ച് ഡേ സിംബളൈസിംഗ് ദ സിഗ്നിഫിക്കൻസ് ഓഫ് ദാറ്റ് പർട്ടിക്കുലർ അവതാർ ആൻഡ് ബെനിഫിറ്റ്സ് after passing the summer equinox as the night grown longer the first nine nights of the upcoming lunar month are more conducive to be receptive to the energies of the divine feminine power the shakti is represented with different names and forms on the pious nine days of navratri goddess durga visits our house to shower her blessings and fill our life with happiness and peace This sadhana culminates on the 10th day called Vijayadashami, the victory of Devi Durga over the demon Mahishasura. Hence, celebrating the victory of good over evil. Listening to mantras are very important because they hold immense power and infinite spiritual energy that helps you to reach to the Almighty. They are supposed to create vibrations that re-surround in the universe and and bring peace of mind and happiness to us when we chant them we are presenting each devi's stuti the dhyana shloka and the beej mantra in respective order set to different ragas reflecting the bhava of that particular form of shakti the first day is for devi shailaputri she represents parvati in her stage of childhood Goddess Shailaputri is the daughter of mountains and is the absolute form of mother nature. She is depicted as riding on bull Nandi with a trishula in her right hand and lotus in her left hand. Shailaputri is considered to be the direct incarnation of Mahakali. She is also considered to be a reincarnation of Sati from her previous birth, also known as Hemavati. The color associated with Goddess Shailaputri is yellow. which depicts action and vigor. Devi Brahmacharani is the second incarnation of Navadurga worshipped on the second day of Navaratri. The word Brahmacharani stems from two Sanskrit roots. Brahma means the one self-extinct spirit, the absolute reality. Charya means to follow. She is the unmarried form of Goddess Parvati who was born at the home of Daksha Prajapati. She is the Goddess of Purity peace and sacredness she is depicted as walking bare feet and holding a japa mala or rosary and a kamandala or pot in her hand she symbolizes bliss and calm the green color depicts the flow of energy everywhere chandraganda goddess chandraganda the third incarnation of goddess shakti is the married form of goddess parvati who mounts on the tigress and is depicted with 10 hands holding fierce weapons always ready to battle with enemies it is believed that the sound of the moon bell on her forehead expel all type of spirits away from her devotees she is the embodiment of beauty and is also symbolic of bravery grace and courage The color associated with her is grey. It symbolizes zeal and determination to destroy evil. Goddess Kushmanda worshipped on the fourth day. Ku means a little, Ushma means warmth or energy and Anda means cosmic egg. She is the creative power of the universe. She is centered inside the sun and is the cause of energy and light of the sun. Kushmanda is depicted with eight hands holding a trident, discus, sword, hook, mace, bow, arrow and two jars of honey and blood. Her one hand is always on Abhya Mudra from which she blesses all her devotees. She is believed to be the creative power of the universe. She is associated with the endowment of vegetation on earth and hence the color of the day is orange. it signifies brightness knowledge and tranquility skanda mata is the goddess worshiped on panchami the fifth day is the mother of skanda or kartikeya she is depicted riding on a ferocious lion having four arms one of her hands 
is the fear dispelling abhya mudra while the other hand is used to hold the infant the remaining two hands are typically shown holding lotus flowers white is the color of the day it represents purity peace and meditation white is also symbolic of the transforming strength of a mother when her child is confronted with danger the sixth day maka durga is worshiped as devi katyayini she was created from the combined energies of goats when their anchor at the daman mahishasura devi katyayini is worshiped on the 6th day of navaratri she was created from the combined energies of the goats when their anchor at the daman mahishasura manifested itself in the form of energy rays the rays crystallized in the hermitage of katyayana rishi who gave it a proper form therefore she is called katyayani daughter of katyayana she is the mahishasura mardini the slayer of mahishasura the warrior goddess She is considered to be the most violent forms of Devi. In this avatar, Kathyayani rides on a lion with four hands. She is the form of Parvati, Mahalakshmi and Mahasaraswati. The color associated with her is red, which signifies beauty, courage and fearlessness. Kalaratri Devi Kalaratri is worshipped on the seventh day of Navaratri. She is the most ferocious form of Goddess Durga. It is believed that Parvati removed her pale skin to kill demons Shumbha and Nishumbha. She destroys evil to restore peace and dharma. She blesses her devotees with Abhaya and Varada Mudras. The goddess appears in tiger skin with a lot of rage in her fiery eyes with dark skin. The color associated with her is royal blue. Blue color symbolizes immense power and divine energy. Devi Mahagauri is the eighth incarnation of Goddess Durga and is celebrated on day 8 of Navaratri. She symbolizes happiness, purity, intelligence and peace. When Goddess Shailaputri was young, she was very beautiful and had an extremely fair complexion. That avatar is known as Mahagauri. Maha means great, Gauri means bright and clean. Mahagauri is usually depicted with four arms the hands holding a trident a fear dispelling gesture a drum while the fourth is a blessing gesture she adorns white clothes hence she is called shwedambara dhara the color associated with devi mahagauri is pink which depicts freshness desires youthfulness and romance Goddess Siddhidatri is the ninth and final among the Navadurgas worshipped on the ninth day of Navaratri. Siddhi means supernatural power or meditative ability and Dhatri means giver also known as Mahalakshmi. Devi Siddhidatri is the Mooli Rupa of Goddess Parvati. Siddhidatri is also seen as Ardhanarishwara form of Shiva and Shakti. In this form Durga is seated on a lotus four armed holds lotus maize chakra and shankha and she removes ignorance and provides knowledge according to vedic scriptures lord shiva attained all the siddhis by worshiping goddess siddhidatri she is believed to have blessed brahma vishnu and mahadev with eight of the ultimate divine powers called siddhis she offers all types of siddhis to her devotees so she is known as siddhidatri the color associated with devi Siddhidhatri is purple. Purple represents ambition and power to achieve your aspirations. Purple also portrays an admiration towards nature's beauty. This Navaratri series is a humble attempt by us to bring out the specific qualities and siddhis of each deities of Navadurga. Wishing all of you a blissful Navaratri. May Goddess Durga shower her blessing on all of you. Thank you.